we are going to learn two most user commands in Photoshop that is Ctrl Z and Ctrl Alt Z. First of all, create a new document. Go to File menu, click on New or use Keyboard Shortcut Ctrl plus N. Now I am going to create new document with properties with 12 inches height, 8 inches resolution, 72 color mode RGB, background contents as white. Click OK button. Now I am going to write some numbers using brush tool. Brush tool, keyboard shortcut B. I am writing 1, writing 2, writing 3, writing 4, writing 5, writing 6, writing 7. Now I want to undo my action. That is, what is my last action? Writing 7. This 7 has to be removed. Now I have to use command Ctrl Z. Now I want to redo my action. That is, I want my 7 back. What I have to do? Again, I should press Ctrl Z. It means my Ctrl Z is acting alternatively as undo and redo commands. When we use Ctrl Z command first time it will perform as undo command and when we use ctrl z command second time it will perform as redo command now let us see what will happen when i press ctrl alt z sound has been removed and if i press ctrl alt z now my 6 has been removed and again pressing ctrl alt z again ctrl alt z again ctrl alt z again ctrl alt z it means by pressing Ctrl Alt Z, my last performed actions has been removed. It means it is working like a step backward function, which can go to up to my first created action. That is creating a new document. We can see it in history palette. Now I want my number one, which is my first action. You should press Ctrl Shift Z command, which is a step forward command. Edit menu step forward my two number has been given which is my action 2 again pressing step forward my 3 has been given which is my third action so if suppose now I want to remove this 3 now what I have to do I have to press step backward alt ctrl z it's so simple this is the way to use Ctrl Z and Ctrl Alt Z and Ctrl Shift Z commands in Photoshop.